So my backpack got left at the Korean barbecue place because we did not have an armor bear that had the presence of mind. I know you're not talking about me. To bring it. I should just start over. So here's the thing. In our rush to get away from the pork bellies. <laughs> for school of the prophets and seers in los angeles but first whole foods we're going to get some nice healthy salads for our lunch break i would encourage you to take care of your body it's the temple of the holy spirit i hear some of you right now saying don't lecture me i'm not but i've been unhealthy and i've been healthy and guess what your health your physical body also affects your emotions so if you're not happy then you're not whole amen and if you're sick in your body then you're not whole so let's go whole foods run Let me teach you a lesson on synergy. So Prof Vanessa is getting our marvelous gluten-free sandwiches for lunch while I am doing the water run and the vegetable chips run. Now I just can't find one more thing that we can go to the School of the Prophets. You know what, being prepared, having a checklist. People take these things for granted, but that's part of the secret of my productivity success. I know what I need, I know where I'm going, I know what I'm aiming for. Even in a Whole Foods I've never been in before, which is quite different from the one at home, I am ready, locked and loaded. I prophesy over you, be locked and loaded. Opportunities are coming your way, it's your time. Now I have a headache. My 
passport, my computer, everything. Maybe I should just start over. So, here's the thing. In our rush to get away from the pork bellies, <laughs> we left my backpack there and everything's in it. So what you do in that case is you ask the angels to go. Because I need my passport, I need my computer, everything I have is in there that I need. So we're rushing back from Chipotle. I told you that was a bad idea. Pork bellies. I'm believing that the angels protected my bag. When you've been ministering all day and you're starving, you're not thinking about your bag. You're thinking about your Korean barbecue that turned out to be pork bellies, and we don't like pork bellies. Let's see if she got it. Pray, pray, pray. You're gonna have to see, check where you have your stuff. Here. It was sitting right there on the floor. Just all new people around it. Nobody even touched it. Nobody touched it. You see this? This is what we're looking for. This is the bowl. You send angels on assignment when you can't find a thing. When you left a thing, God provides. Now we're going back to Chipotle because now the event is starting in 15 minutes. And my belly is not full of pork, but it needs to be full of something. All right, let's go. All right, well, it's time to go to the impartation night. I don't know what the flow is, don't know what to expect. I know it's windy outside and my hair is blowing. So, no bueno. Time to go inside. Impartation service. You never know what to expect in an impartation service. Derek Gates, great guy. Let's go. Jennifer to be to be a covering in my life because I saw the integrity on her life um, and and I believe that you always need to be a part of something bigger than yourself now is the strongest word in the English language it not it, it, it's not that it might be established or that it could be established or if you pray hard enough and fast enough that it will be so it shall it's yeah. a done deal so it's a done deal As you can see, we had a great meeting. The only problem now is that Vanessa drove us to the wrong hotel in the middle of the night, so we're actually staying in a loft. She brought us to the Hampton Inn. Imagine my disconsternation when they had no reservation and we had to spend 30 minutes getting on Wi-Fi and searching for the actual reservation. This is what happens when you travel constantly, when you switch hotel brands, and when you're really tired. So I'm gonna go find her because...